Working in an emergency call center is a stressful job, and in Sandusky County, they came up with a creative way to cope with the challenges of the job. Yeah, apparently, he walks on four legs and works for treats. Lisa Guyton went to Fremont today to meet him and joins us live with the story new at five. Lisa. Uh, Lee and Diane, Georgie is a comfort canine that works in the 911 dispatch center. While life is good now, that was not the case in the beginning. He was found wandering the streets and ended up in a shelter. Those who helped save him say he's returned the favor many times over. Meet Georgie. He's one of the top dogs at the Sandusky County Communications Center. He lives here 24-7, 365. He has his own very plush bed, baskets overflowing with toys, outfits. Tina Anderson is the director of communications for the Sandusky County Sheriff's Office and the one who led the charge to get a dog for the dispatch center. I have always found great comfort in the companionship of animals, just like many people, but a lot of times that's not something we can take to work with us. Georgie's time in the shelter led him to a special training program and eventually his new life. He ended up being enrolled in a prison dogs program and he was at a correctional institution for eight months and I found his little face on, on a pet finder and just fell in love with him. It's easy to see how that happened. And Georgie has been making a difference since the day he arrived in Fremont. He can sense when you're not quite feeling yourself. He picks up on the vibe. Katie Schwartz is the assistant supervisor of the center. If he wants your attention, he sits behind you and just gives you that side eye and then he'll get his little wolf going and it's, oh, it's so funny. Katie loves watching Georgie at work. When some people aren't comfortable talking to another person as far as something that's bothering them or, you know, maybe they had a rough day at work, they had a rough call. So it's nice knowing that they can find comfort in just even sitting down with him for five minutes, taking some quiet time. The benefits are both social and emotional. You've got reduced stress rates, um, cortisol levels go down, oxytocin, uh, dopamine, serotonin all go up, your blood pressure, your heart rate, everything starts to stabilize. And this can be a stressful environment, so we definitely are reaping those rewards from having him in our company. Like a lot of dogs, Georgie's paw prints have left a mark on a lot of hearts. You can come to them when you're feeling broken, you can come to them when you don't see anything bright going on in your world and they will give you their whole heart. They will give you everything that they have and sometimes we need more of that in the world. We sure do. Uh, Georgie will celebrate his one year anniversary at the communication center in August. There will be a puppy party to mark the milestone and the deputies hope Georgie's story encourages others to adopt a shelter pet and to follow his story and his outfits. Check out the Sandusky County Communications Center Facebook page. Uh, reporting live, Lisa Guyton, 13 Action News. Beautiful, huh? Yeah, I think he needs a bigger hat, though. You think so? <laughs> You're a little too small. Yeah, he's quite, quite the crime fighter, though, Georgie. Yeah. is go-getter. Lisa, thanks for that. Well, uh,